Okay, so this is my foundry. I'm gonna try and set it off today and see if we can melt some me some some copper, because you know, aluminum's for noobs. Now what we got here is a 30 euro leaf blower, the cheapest I could find, which I've just added a string here so that it stays on all the time, and what will actually be used as the on switch is plugging in it or not. Then pretty standard, just tube connecting straight in, coal fired. Now the reason why this is gonna be hard is because it's got to work on coal, and coal, as we all know, well, doesn't get very hot. But still, we're going to try. Now, of course, we've got our safety goggles, and, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. I got my, this is going to be the, I don't know, the crucible, because it's steel. Hopefully, hopefully it's steel. Now, the top is plastic, and that will melt off. But, you know, no big. Whatever. Okay, so, sis, we're gonna light her up. If you can get the match off. Ah! Okay. Safety goggles, of course. Hey, I, I'm, ex I'm expecting an explosion here. I got this problem, which is that the, the roof here keeps breaking up with the heat. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> they won't work. Put it there, that one in the corner. Just, you don't need to drop it, look, just give me that. Blame it on science. It's, yeah, blame it on science. Don't blame it on me. Okay, this is, this is exploding time. Go away. Oh, yeah. Okay, and now... That's the technique. Hey, well, your one has caught... Ah! Ow. Oh, it didn't work. Oh, your one did. Oh. Okay, It's now. a safety glasses. You need the safety glasses for it to work. And now we get to go like this safety and then glasses. give it a wee puff. No, no, safety glasses first. Uh. Alright, the safety glasses. Right. This would be a nice campfire. And I ask myself, what am I doing here? Hey, you safety glasses. Safety glasses, Eric. Safety glasses, put them on, Eric. Okay, that's hot, so now Eric, I can just go. Put the safety glasses on. Eric, the safety glasses. There we go. I see fire. I miss the eye of the mountain below. Ah, no, 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 this is so. This is not dangerous in any way. This fire is sparking up. Oh my god. Uh. Now the thing with a charcoal fire, no. the thing with a, uh, with a charcoal fire at least here is that it spews up all this gunge, which is really annoying and it makes for very bad metal yeah, I agree. quality. Yeah. So it got a lid. Okay. So I'm putting my copper in. And there we go. This is a super easy DIY project. You can just do it at home with things you can find. Just like in your cupboards, okay? Yeah. So step one, place it in your homemade furnace that I'll never teach you how to make. And then just insert some of your homemade charcoal. Yeah. <coughs> homemade. Organic. Why don't you just DIY it instead of buying it? Uh-huh. It was super cheap, super inexpensive. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm so proud of my creation. So this is the final look of it. The final look. Safe distance. It's December, December. December shorts. This video is getting boring. Panorama time. Lid. 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 Okay, so that's been going on for a while. I'm gonna see if everything is working okay. So yeah, so as we can see, the top's burned off, which was to be expected. 
got my kitchen gloves because you know mom wants her son to be safe okay so that didn't work copper still wasn't melted but i mean i only left it there for like five minutes so duh but i broke the rock yes because i'm awesome <laughs> so now i get this funky looking lid trying to coordinate the camera and all is hard I might want uh, the bitter, a bigger lid because I'm losing a lot of heat. Now that's much better. Oh, after let's say 10 minutes of letting it go tremendously. So I have actually removed it, and sadly, my thing was my crucible is burnt up. But you see that? See that? That is copper. I mean, it was copper before too, but but still, it's changed shape. Oh my god. So, that proves that copper has been molten at some point. Now, I'm not going to say that it melted through my crucible because that'd be, a, that'd be me going too far. Because it obviously hasn't. It's just, you know, steel under some circumstances burns and... Well, it burned. Because if it would have molten, it would have molten the bottom, which it did not. I mean, it has burnt through it, because you can see a bit of copper shining through. I'm not sure with the camera, because the camera gives it a different color. But here, I have copper. That is copper. That's been molten some stage of its life. So here is where I go. Yes, you can melt copper with... A charcoal fire and this is like um this is the cheapest charcoal I could find. This is the 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 garbage. This whole bag cost me like uh three euros. Yeah, three euros something. So by no means high quality stuff. But it's all to do with the blower. Well the blower's been doing its job just very nicely and I I'm actually very happy with it. So here's where I go and put the meme. Yeah, that's awesome. Bye.